Being a multicultural nation of Chinese, Malaysian and Indian influences adds to its complexity. Don't let Singapore's strict, efficient, conservative reputation make you think it's a dull town. It's a fascinating and diverse nation, full of color, contrasts and flavors that are well worth exploring. Fear not, but keep a few don'ts in mind while enjoying your visit. Here are 8 things not to do in Singapore. Don't chew gum, unless you have prescription, you can be fined $500 if you dare to chew and drop it. Don't forget to flush, this is one of the things not to do in Singapore that most people have heard about. Now, this is a courtesy that most people would appreciate, but Singapore just takes it to a legal extreme. You can be fined $150 for this offense. Don't walk around naked or look at porn, even in private, nudity is no-no in Singapore. It seems like a hard one to enforce, even in the privacy of your own home, akin to pornography. It can actually result in fine up to $2,000 or up to three months in jail. Don't litter. Like the chewing gum ban mentioned before, littering of any kind, including spitting, is more than just frowned upon in Singapore. It's an offense that can result in a $1,000 fine. You may also be sentenced to community service. Don't snack on the MRT. If you do decide to take public transit, hope you don't get the munchies on board. Singapore's MRT has officially been a no eating or drinking zone since 1987. Fines can be up to $500 for daring to bite. Don't smoke in public. Public smoking is also prohibited. There are some designated places where you are permitted to puff, but don't just light up in Singapore without thinking. There's a $200 fine if you mess up. Don't do drugs, even before you arrive. Capital punishment is not unheard of here. However, you can get into trouble for having drugs in your system when arriving in Singapore, even if you ingested them before you stepped foot in the country. Don't finger point, this one seems kind of minor after that last life or death don't, but visitors to Singapore should be aware that pointing an index finger at someone is perceived as rude. Body language and gestural codes vary from country to country. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more videos.